What's going on, Jay? What's up, man? Oh, bo- what up, bro? What up, bro? Hey! What's up, bro? How are you? Okay. How are you, man? Good, good. You're looking good, man, I'm and trying. sounding good. I'm trying, brother. I'm trying, but it's uh, I'm I'm so happy to be here. This is uh, I've been watching this since I was six. Dude, I've been watching you since I was 16. Get out of here. <laughs> Get out. I'm like, wait a second. 2000 and 2010. Is it possible? Yes, I guess it is. Wow. With all these voices you make and everything and imitations, that, do you ever? Does anything ever slip out when you're kind of talking normal? <laughs> yeah, that happens a few times. Uh, I would say Denzel and Eddie Murphy and Will Smith probably slip out just a little bit in conversation. I hear some Denzel come out of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just a little Denzel, you know. You know, sometimes it just slips out. You know, you just got a lot of lovely people here, so you got to make sure. <laughs> huh? All right, see. I'm drunk now. Yeah, I'm drunk. I'm drunk now. <laughs> Dude, what did you know? Lights. You when did you know you had it? You you could do this. You were just a master. What six. did you know? At six, man. Um, at six years old, that was my first voice, and um, some some told me I was good at it, and I just kept going. So, yeah. But as far as being able to get on stage to perform, 10. Yeah. You were the best at it. Thank who, you. Who are you working on now? Oh, man. Uh, well, you got to get the Dragon Ball characters, right? I'm trying to make sure I get Goku down. I, I got Sean's voice down, kind of the Vegeta. I got the old Vegeta. You know what I mean? I got a, you know, Piccolo. Piccolo is just Piccolo. You know, he's just, he's just a black dude. Do me Piccolo. Oh, isn't it? Okay, cool. All right, all right. Let me make sure I can do this. All right. Mm. Mm. Vegeta. Vegeta, you should. Uh, see, my voice is, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. it's there, it's there. Vegeta. Okay, that's all you get. You, you, know, you know, one thing that you do, because I watch you a lot on YouTube, yeah, by yeah. the way, and you start to make, you become the face of it, of, of Kevin Hart and Rock and everybody, too. So that's part of bringing the voice? Yeah, bringing the voice is like, is you got to envision the character as you're doing it. I guess even with the Dragon Ball characters, it'd be the same thing. You yeah, know, yeah. you're doing that. And I'm sorry, I gave you half a piccolo. I gave you- <laughs> Dude, I'd rather have a half or a quarter piccolo with you than, than no piccolo. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. What's going on right now next for you? Last few questions. What, what's going? What's what's the future of Jay Farrell? I got a movie dropping next month with Leslie and Kim Jong. Kim Jong. Uh, it's out of office. That's gonna be dope. Uh, I got another movie uh, with uh, Tim Story directed it, The Blackening. I got the bio a biopic for Casablanca Records, Buddha, Buddha Records. That's about to drop. The movie I did with Anderson Park, Her, Meryl Streep. Uh, that's an animated one that's dropping on Netflix, and I shot another movie with um, uh, God dang it, a uh, hot. What is he? Uh, what is the joke? He the, the, the joke. He's. I know the guy. I'm trying to remember his name right now. I know him. I'm looking at his face. I can't. God dang. Ah, uh, you know what he does? He does the he does the uh, joke about hot pockets. You know what I'm talking about? Hot pockets. He goes hot hot pockets. Oh. He talks like that. Jim Gaffigan. Jim Gaffigan. I, I was just about to say God day. We both, it took that long to get there. <laughs> wow. Yes, Jim Gaffigan. When you got your first big paycheck, what'd you do with it? <laughs> I don't freaking, what did I do with my first big paycheck? I don't know, man. I uh, I think I went to, um, I went to Cheesecake Factory. That's okay. what I did. Okay. Yeah. What was your very first email address? Uh, my first email address was um, lyricallydenicest at AOL.com. Oh. DA, cool. not the DA nicest, yeah. Okay. I had to put a little, you know, little flavor in that. All right, all right. Dude, you're just, you're the master. You're the master of Hollywood of all the voices. You're the king, you're the. I'm like, yo, oh shit, it's, oh, pic- oh, it's Piccolo. Oh, that's, uh... I gotta wait. No, okay, now I have to. All right, now I gotta do it. I gotta do it correctly. We gotta find the Dragon Balls, man. Yeah, we do. Oh, wow, dang. Yeah, we. <laughs> We gotta absolutely, find, absolutely. We gotta Gohan. find the Dragon Balls. Go on, we have to find the Dragon Ball. I don't, that sound like the narrator more than anything <laughs> right now. Your eyes, also I was like, wait, I'm trying to get him. I'm trying to get him down. He just, but if I did one of him and just, we gotta find those Dragon Balls. I just, that's spot on. That's Piccolo right there. If I could give you a wish to do a movie with a particular actor or two, who would it be? Oh come on, man! It'd be uh, <laughs> be Denzel Washington, uh, and uh, Eddie Murphy. And uh, also, I love to do one with um, uh, Pete Holmes. He's freaking hilarious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and Sam Rockwell. Oh, God, yeah. What? What? Yeah, Sam Rockwell and Margot Robbie, you know. You, you Denzel, and Eddie, you could be the lost brother. I could. I'd be right there in the Your middle. Eyes, you looked like Eddie when you said it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You, you know. Like, dude, you're like a, 
a phone. You're like a second, like just, just you can do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you, man. Just yeah, I can. I got. They call me Play-Doh Face. That's what it is. Welcome to Fab TV. Look at Hollywood's latest. See all the red carpets dressed to a T. Yeah, you know me. It's all free.